say. All right, there we go. Let, let's take a look here, though. Soviet forces are now only 2,000 above me. Um, yeah, so that is a uh, uh, so AF rates. That's fine. Heavy industry. All right. Black Sea Amphibious HQ. Do I have to attack it or something? Uh, I can't really do anything with it, but uh, the thing is, yeah. No, that, that didn't work. Fine. Let's just see though. Um, because these guys are all part of this core. Mm. Seems like I left that one hex. I guess through the mud it's going to be, be a bit more difficult to just straight up advance. Why is the full cough run there too? That's very weird. My uh, rail line obviously is not not working here. I mean, I, I do have supplies at these ports, but since there's no rail line, I, I cannot push that up anyway. Neither of these units can advance more than one hex. Except the core unit, apparently. That's pretty funny. Given the mod, this is, it makes a lot of sense that this isn't going very quickly. have water level nine. The fifty second core is the one that's going to be moving down here. I don't think I need another core of the first eh. Let's just send them down. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I do think Yeah. 
I should just continue further down with this. Might get into Darebent on the next turn. Uh, either which way. I'll uh, keep the sixty eighth core around here for the moment. Okay, do I already have the rail into Grozny itself? I'm not actually sure. I did, okay, so I did put it to Grozny and then moved it up there. Well, three... Three... Four and four. No, this is a lot of walking. Okay, let's move that up. There are no other units except them now. Uh, but... I don't think that attacking from that side of the river is that great of an idea. I'll just... Uh, Do this. Because they'll have to move all the way back anyway, but. Fourth Romanian, huh? Let's put you on it. Don't want any non. German units in their caucuses anymore. They are valiantly working on that railroad there too. Now past Tuapsa, so that's nice. This mountain unit is unready. But... Can't really do a whole lot for it at the moment, since there's they're so far away from any potential rail that... That's not... I'm gonna gonna work basically can keep him on there try to refit him but I'd be surprised if anything was to get through all the way there You're part of Army Group A. Um, there was a unit, this one, that I needed to put in the fourth, not under the sixth.
Okay. Just uh, feeling about for the Soviet units here. Um, hmm. And then I'll take those two units there too. In the process for now. So they have two units. Ideally, I'll not let them cross. Um, I don't really care though if they link up the main concern here is to make sure that they run out of uh, supplies and movement points etc so that eventually I'll be able to deal with them ready unready Means I'm kind of stuck there. Can take a few hexes around the city. These guys are also as unready as can be. Um, Two thousand units only. And they can still move around, take a few hexes. Alright. As usual, I'll do the easier parts first, and uh, whatever that means. I'll have these guys go and also deal with that down there. So that'll be a bit easier to take that down. Um, right, this will not very likely work on the first attempt. Guess it does. Barely, though. Four rifle divisions, thirty three thousand. do now is I'll of course go for Leningrad from multiple sides here I'll move quite a few of these back so that they might attack on the next turn let's get you back together I don't really see the AI attacking These aren't that many units, but like this I might be able to try soon. 
Um, at least I got one part of Leningrad, so that's nice. I don't see myself being able to take this either. Yet. But let's move these guys around. Okay, um... What I'll do here is I'll have this core take up positions two hexes from each other over here is the 38th core And they'll move up, even though there's nothing there, like I said. And then I'll have the first core move upon Cherepovets. Even though its movement is about to turn as disastrous as the other one. Okay, got a rifle core there. That is something at least. I can cut these guys off just a little bit more. I think it doesn't matter that much, but... Right, that was really not the way I wanted to do that. Uh, let's just keep you in ready and actually move these to Kalinin for refitting. They're 39 anyway. And then let's get this motorized unit in. Okay, I guess certainly not. Let's get the Panzers to refit. There are quite a few units that need to leave here as well. Units like the 95th. a lot of AA regiments.
All right, good. Let's also deal with these tanks here. Very nice. And I'll continue to make trouble for the units around here. Let's work on the rail. At least I got it into Vipinsk now. Oh, no. Okay. Um, one thing I, I kind of need to encircle this unit too, if I can help it. So, Let's continue this. And yeah, keep moving in this direction. So from Yaroslavl. I'll take care of the depots later. For the moment, I cannot allow them also to go, to take over the rail line. So moving in this direction is fine. Yeah, Gorky is even empty.
But I can't move the HQ, and my units are pretty much out of all possible movements. I mean, if they're going to put up some kind of defense there, my units have no combat value whatsoever, um, being so far out. Um, Penza is not even worth any points. I'll try attacking these guys every time, but it's very unlikely it will be done soon. Try that a second time with other units, and again, no. Wow. Okay, then. Okay, nope. Hmm. Well, at any rate, I'll fix up this rail line.
and I'm almost done there. Go to depot, depot. Friendly enough, I'm now better off just moving them to this side of Stalingrad, given that uh, I, from next turn I'll be having three rails going into it. Um, any which way, I am kind of done here for now. So... I want to thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. This okay. Well, if you did, please do consider leaving a like, comment, or subscribe. Soviets now 3.175 in terms of manpower. Uh, we can take a look at this, but total men, Soviets still going down a cliff. Guns, we actually have more guns on the battlefield than they do now. AVs, but I assume it's still stagnant, interestingly enough. Aircraft up by a lot. Manpower losses remains high for the Soviets. Etc, etc, etc. Fuel stores, I'm still going down. Oil stores, now going up, but I don't have the production to deal with it, so that's kind of the problem. So even though I'm getting more oil now than before, whereas the Soviets are going down in oil now. It's, uh, yeah. Anyway, with them abandoning the Caucasus, I could just take it as I please. And then indeed, we have Saratov, Kribyshev, Kazan, and Gorky left as, and Leningrad, as what are the uh, remaining points for the Soviets currently. And Moscow, shouldn't forget Moscow. Right. It'll be a while. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care. See you next time.